explain the tie back. The tie back is a leash that attaches to your dog when they're on place or in a duration command, like down uh, in the same spot over and over again. So my place spot is always right here next to this window. So I like to keep this tie back right here. It lets the dog get off the bed and make that mistake. Say if there's a distraction like a cat and they want to chase it and they're not fully trained yet, uh, but they can't get far enough to you know chase her or have any fun. So they're not self-rewarded. So just keep them safely tied back. If you're answering the door, they can't run out the door, uh, but it lets you you know correct them, put it in the mess. Just to add on to what Gabby said, if your dog is on place and they break without release um, for a distraction like the cat or someone coming in the door, if they make it up to that person or animal, even for just a second, they are rewarded. Mm -hmm. So if they're rewarded for breaking a command, even if you correct them and put them back, they're always gonna remember the reward and they're gonna keep doing it. So if you have a tie back on, they're only gonna make it to right here before they get a correction and are put back. They're going to stop breaking because they're not being rewarded for that behavior anymore. What we do for place proofing is what we call role playing where we put him on place, he doesn't know it's a training session. We start presenting distractions, knowing that we are training. So we've got our remote, we've got, we're have got we prepared. We're not waiting for the real thing. Because if we're waiting for the real thing, we're gonna be fumbling through it. So we've got, Gabby has the remote, and we're basically presenting things that we think are going to get him to make a mistake. Toys, the cat. Knock on the door, the, door. the cat, I'm here. Who is it? thing is is that he knows the difference when he is released he'll be playing like crazy but we have to have our dogs know the difference between when they're working and when they're playing if they don't know the difference everything is muddied everything's cloudy they're gonna be breaking all the time they're not gonna understand you're not consistent with the rules so they're not gonna be consistent in holding their command good boy I'll leave him on there for a while, but back there, keep the leash off just so he knows the exact different age of fly off. Right? Yes, yeah, good boy. 